There's something that is quite magical about the building itself, actually, with the you know the, the tall, thin nature of the building, right. the steps that you have to go up to find the screens. The way the screens themselves are so different. Um, the more modern screen two and the very traditional screen one. And then, of course, the biggest thing about the little, the thing which I think brings people back, is the, uh, the people that work here. I mean, I'm not speaking about myself, of course, but there are some fantastic people here, caring people who really enjoy working with the public, who do their best for people that come in. And I feel that we're just a part of the community, the cinema. We're more than just the films that we show here. I think a sense of community is probably the most important thing to the audience because they, yeah, they seem to value that mostly. Um, whether it's a community, and I think it's a community in the sense that of this place, not necessarily the other customers. It's like when they come here, they feel welcome. They feel it's a friendly place. Sometimes they, if they come with other people, they know, um, you know, like other friends to come here and stuff as well. Um, but yeah, it's a very welcoming place. We have a lot of people who come to Silver Screen week in, week out, and it's part of their week, part of the fabric of their week, I suppose, and they, they like to come along, they have their free tea or coffee, and uh, yeah, they just, and we know them because they, you know, once they've turned up for a few weeks, they get to have a, a chat, you get to know what they, you know, what, what they think of the film, what they're, and they tell you a bit about themselves and their families and so on, which is nice. I think what makes us different from a run-of-the-mill cinema, if you like, is, is the fact that we're much more relaxed about our attitude to people um, and we want them to feel comfortable in the environment. So it's, it's yeah, it's creating a homey environment for people, not cold and, and clinical. That's kind of where we, you know, that's our strength, I think, yeah. And customer service, of course, as well. Weirdly, I, I, I always wanted to be in film, something to do with film. Like, as a kid, I wanted to be a director, but I ended up putting on film, so, you know, it's it's... Yeah, so I love, I love the fact of putting on film for people and I get that same feeling I did when I first watched films as a kid, when the screen gets bigger. It's like I get that buzz every, every day, so it's fantastic, yeah. But the position I'm in, I'm, I'm able to still do projecting. A lot of stuff become, is becoming automated, but here we're kind of, we're, we're digging our heels in a bit. We want to keep it as true as possible. So we do still show 35 millimeter film. We do open the masking. We do the lights ourselves. So, so that, that part of my job is, is still very exciting. People have to understand that to be able to show the other side of film and, and films that, that maybe are more of a niche audience, you still have to be able to survive. So of course, to get those films, you have to do deals with distri distributors. So, so it's very important to show them that you'd be crazy to do it. We wouldn't be able to survive. because it's like um, a, a cosy family really um, and they show, often show unusual films and have started doing live opera which is wonderful um, and it's the variety um, and the fact that it's a very laid back place, you know, very relaxed and good fun and the staff are fun and you know, it's a good experience I would say. <laughs>